like one of my favorite trails here in uh, the Cullen Park. Uh, it's kind of fast and flowy. Uh, really cool. apologize to all my subscribers that uh, I haven't really been uh, making mountain bike videos lately. Uh, one is because the pandemic, the COVID, uh, also uh, I was having some back issues, uh, hurting in my back really bad so it was like really hard to ride. So, hey, that's a, oh, that's a new trail. Huh. <clears throat> so yeah, so uh, I haven't been making videos, but now since the weather's getting better and my back is getting better, I. Uh, Back on the trail again. <laughs> I could, I've been working out, uh, but working out and getting back out on the trail is two different things. Uh, when you're out on the trail, uh, you push yourself a lot more than you think you do. You know, just working out. <laughs> home or at a gym. It's a totally different thing. So, I feel like I'm still in good, I feel like I'm still in pretty decent shape for riding, uh, but I'm not exactly where I, where I was before. <laughs> so, but hard work, effort, uh, that's going to help me uh, get back in shape again. This is so nice. This is really nice. Uh, yeah, I'm not using my GoPro right now uh, on this video. I'm using my uh, backup camera. Uh, my backup, well, I'm not using my new GoPro <laughs> or my newest GoPro, Black 8, uh, or my new bro GoPro. Uh, as y'all saw in the live stream, I was showing that camera. But I'm using my old backup camera, so hope the videos come out okay. <clears throat> uh, wow, this is awesome. This is awesome. It's like a little fairy tale place, you know? Kind of dreamy. It'll look nice. Okay. <clears throat> Uh, they got these signs up. I gotta see what's going on here. Wow. I 
but I'm staying. <laughs> uh, this is really awkward, y'all. Uh, I've been riding these trails for a long time out here. And I'm on the trail and I come to the end of the trail not knowing, <laughs> not knowing that they posted signs saying no mountain bikes on the trail. Uh, so I'm very shocked because uh, all the mountain bikers are the ones that made all these trails in, in here. The mountain bike community is the ones thing. You know, they work very hard uh, out here in Colon Park to, to make all these trails. And so now I'm seeing these signs saying no, no mountain bikes allowed in the park. So, I'm going to run over here real quick and see what's going on. Because if that's the case, that's just going to just tell me. No bikes on any trails. The wonderful piece. Oh no. I didn't know that. Then his parents, she wants the park to be a place of a beautiful donated bikes and motorcycles. Wow. Wow. I am totally shocked now, y'all. Uh, I can't believe this. Uh, I haven't been out here in a while. So, uh, yeah, this is, uh, this is crazy. Wow. Wow, this is crazy. No more mountain bikes allowed here. Oh my gosh, I can't believe this. This is absolutely crazy, y'all. Uh, so I gotta, I can't ride on the trails, so I have to just walk my bike. I, I didn't even see a sign in the front that said anything about mountain bike when I first got on the trail. I didn't. There wasn't no sign on the first trail, so this is crazy. <laughs> this is absolutely crazy. They just want it for hiking, no mountain biking. So I was wondering why people were kind of looking at me. I didn't know. Damn, that sucks. Huh? You flat? No, I I just noticed the signs that says uh, no mountain bikes. <laughs> uh, so don't worry about it, man. Man, I've been riding out here for years. <laughs> so have I. I'm one of the, me and Larry and the other guys are the ones that made all these trails out here. Yeah. Sickens me as they I, I'm really trails. shocked. <laughs> yeah. Man. Well, you you got to get out, so, I mean. Yeah. <laughs> but. Wow, that's a, this is going to be a bummer. <laughs> I know. I live right there in this neighborhood, and, you know, that's why we made these trails to ride them. And, yeah. All of a sudden they shut it down. So. Yeah, he's the initial one that made all these. Yeah. Oh man, thanks. <laughs> yeah, I've been I do my YouTube channel out here, and man, I've been doing it for yeah quite a while. <laughs> so. What do you do? Yeah. Yeah, man. See you later. Okay, I guess I gotta walk it back. <laughs> Wow. Okay, guys, uh, as you heard, uh, he's one of the builders that built these trails out here in Colin Park. So, um, uh, mountain biking is, is not allowed out here anymore. And 
I am really, really, really crushed uh, to find this out this morning. And so uh, I'm going to respect it and uh, uh, walk my bike back. Uh, I'm not going to ride, but I'm not going to ride on the trails. So um, and so oh guys, I can't believe this. This is a uh, this is crazy. Uh, so as you see. I have to walk my bike back and uh, even one of the trail builders right there you just saw him and he and uh, he said that uh, he built he built most of all these trails out here and uh, he seems like he's pretty bummed out about it as well and Wow, this is crazy, y'all. So I have to, I have to get back. I'm gonna walk my bike back. I'm gonna walk out of here. So I, I, uh, yeah. I didn't think. Uh, uh, yeah, I didn't think uh, anything like that would ever happen here. And uh, wow. I guess that was uh, some kind of decision uh, the original owner had made, or whoever owns the land or donated the land, uh, the Cullen family, and uh, I guess they want to keep it, um, I guess they kind of want to keep it as a hiking trail, um, well, this is a, this is uh, very crushing. Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm lost for words because uh, I really I, I wanted to make a plan to come out here and and uh, and make y'all some videos because this is a great place to come out here and ride and. It's beautiful, it's peaceful. Um, I don't see how the mountain bike community is going to, uh, you know, you know, hurt this community park uh, for people to come out here and ride. I just don't, I don't see, I just don't see it, you know. Uh, I mean, mountain bikers came out here and put all their hard work, put all their hard effort into making all these mountain bike trails. And, and now for this to be uh, taken away from the mountain bike community is, is, uh, it's crazy. Uh, it, it just doesn't make sense. And uh, this is probably going to be a long video because I have a long walk and you know what, um, since this is my last time being able to come in here and, and make a mountain bike video, uh, I'm going to, I'm going to make it special, so I'm just going to keep rolling, rolling my camera until I get out of here. And, uh, yeah. I can't believe this job. This is a super shocking to me. So I kind of, this kind of runs my day now. So um, I was looking forward to, and, and I looked over on the other side of the, uh, of uh, Oyster Creek there, I believe it is. And uh, it also had the sign saying no mountain bikers. And I was just out here uh, maybe uh, three weeks ago, maybe. Yeah, I was out here maybe, maybe three weeks ago. So 
Okay, there's that. Roseland tree. Circle for grass, that means a hundred feet. Around this fur crown, the pecan tree. guys, I gotta keep on moving. Uh, uh, man. I'm devastated, y'all. I am like, I, man, I, man, I remember these trails when these little trails were like really tight through here, and all this would grow up all the time, and uh, uh, the trails were just getting developed, and. There wasn't like a whole bunch of riders coming out here riding, but you know, you had your local riders coming out here and enjoying it and, and riding these trails that were being made like <laughs> every weekend or every other weekend or however uh, they were being made. <laughs> uh, but yeah, um, wow. This is, this is hard. This is really hard for me to take in right now, y'all. Um, this was like one of my favorite places to ride. I, I loved riding here. And I feel like uh, the, the city and I feel like the city is now, is now trying to um, kind of trying to come down on the mountain bike uh, community. Uh, for riding mountain bikes in the park and I think that uh, I, I just think that's not a very good decision to, to be making I think that uh, I think if it's a public park and uh, families get out and you know they want to take their kids and uh, ride bikes uh, I thought you know that's what the public park was all about you know it's been like that for years you know, many, many years, and now, now, all this has been, all this hard work that the mountain bike community put into this is all taken away now. It's just, you know, they were keeping these trails clean and, and working hard to, to make all these trails, and, you know, so I, I'm assuming that the mountain bike. Thank you. Uh, One more. Did y'all read the sign up there? Thank you. Did y'all see the sign? Okay. Yeah, they they uh they they took the trails away from the mountain bikers. Which ones these? Yeah, we we can't ride none of them. <laughs> really? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that I've been riding out here for years and. I was riding and I stopped. I saw the sign and it said, uh, "No more mountain bike." Yeah, I've been here every day this week and I've seen tons of people on bikes. I know, but this is the best trail we have here. I know. I I've been I've been out here for years riding. <laughs> I live right down the street and I just found this and oh. I've come out here as much as I can. This place is amazing. Yeah, it, yeah. And I talked to the trail builder a while ago. Uh, yeah, he's kind of crushed about it. So what, what was the impetus for that? You know, I, I'm not for sure. I think the 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 person uh, colon the the one that donated the uh -huh. park uh i guess they just wanted it for hikers and oh man that for sucks. more for like nature and people you know taking oh. pictures and stuff have you been to the trail on Brazos river yes that, i ride there a lot too yeah that place that's really nice too yeah it's not as big as this but it's still nice yeah and i i do all my youtube channel out here i've been doing for years so on your bike or yeah okay. on my bike yeah oh man that sucks <laughs> yeah so yeah, it really sucks. <laughs> yeah. Enjoy it while you can. Have a good day. All right, you too. Y'all be safe. <laughs> I'm 
I'm just gonna go ahead. So I need to try to ride out of here. If I see somebody, I'll just jump off my bike and start walking. This is a long walk. out of the woods and back to the parking lot uh, but uh, uh, this is gonna be a long video but I am going to express my feelings about this park being taken away from the mountain bikers and the mountain bike community because as you saw back there the, the uh, local guy just started riding his bike and and uh, he just started riding his trails recently and so now they took that way away from the local yeah he lives locally here in the neighborhood and uh, so this is a very shocking very depressing and yeah I can't believe they did this to us Yeah, it's a beautiful park here. And yeah, now it's a... Yeah, so this will be the... This is probably... This will be my last time I ever get to go through here. Uh, with my bike. Um, uh, I'm really saddened by it. Super saddened by it. And, uh, because... Uh, this park, these trails, uh, I don't know, it had something magical for me, and, uh, it was, uh, always, um, very joyful to ride through here, and to see, uh, all the hard work that the mountain bike community put into these trails, you know, these trails right here, and, uh, yeah, all the hard work that they put in these trails now is all taken away from the mountain bike community. And uh, um, uh, very not happy. <laughs> yeah, not happy at all. And so, uh, I'm going to... Uh, Go park my bike and I might come on and do a live show real quick about this uh, I think I think it needs to be said and I think that <coughs> you know is for me um, 